Hey everybody, Radioactive here for another video. Today, and this might actually be going out a little bit late because I'm actually uh, recording this at a time it would normally go out. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, today, we have this cylinder. The cylinder fits and hopefully fires ultra darts. I know, everybody's favorite ammo type. Uh, it does fit five of them, and I'm going to leave these two open so that we can test the uh, the actual loading of the darts while in the blaster. Um, we have our little five-shot rotator, and as usual, you will drop the screw in, and come on. And you will screw it down. Pretty, pretty simple, pretty obvious there. And it's tight. That's not gonna come apart or be torqued in a way to break it off that easily. Let's open this up. You will need to remove the air restrictor. That has been done before this video. That doesn't move as easily. Mm. Ah, it's still decent. Um, and I think that's it. Um, I should probably lube the rotator. Just in case. Because the last video we had one tooth that was a problem. I mean, if it's one tooth, that's probably just because it's an artifact, but I think I got everything off that could be a problem there. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and screw all these down, and I'll get back to you once that's done. Alright, we got this thing all put together. Now let's see if, if it's even possible to load it. Yeah, you can get them in there. It's a very specific angle, but it works. Looks not terrible. And uh, let's see how it fires. Uh, I didn't rotate. So, still a problem. I will actually try and fix that between takes. Seems like it fires well. Um, could be lined up a little bit better. Seems like I've given it plenty of room, at least top to bottom. Yeah, I might I might give it a little bit more room in the next version, just so it uh, there's perfect alignment. All right, so I'm going to reopen this thing up, try and fix that rotation issue, try and figure out which barrel it is that's causing the problem. Um, I will get FPS numbers for you, and then um, I guess that'll be it. But I'll, I'll get the FPS numbers, and I'll come back, and I'll show you, obviously. All right. All right. So we do have numbers. So... And I did fix this, uh, the rotation. I will show you that in a minute. But we have uh, 79 4, 67 7, 77 2, 82 8, and 78 4. So we are looking at mid to high 70s. Um, pretty good numbers, honestly, for this Ultra. So if you have any special Ultra, like, I don't know, Super Zombies or. Special shield rolls or point score. I don't know. I don't know what you'd have. Um, but let's let's get this shown. Really nice. The rotation is nice and crisp. Um, there was an artifact that I hadn't seen, um, so that that did cause problems. Um, 
this is honestly the last thing I have planned for this blaster. I, I can't really think of anything else that I would like to do that really makes sense for me to do. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it's never going to beat or even come close to uh, the hammer shot in terms of modability and performance and stuff like that. But it, some people may enjoy this. Um, if you liked what you saw, subscribe, like, comment. I did reach a thousand subscribers uh, by the time the last video was posted. So thank you everybody for that. Um, really means a lot to me. Um, maybe I can figure out something to do for a thousand subscriber special. I, I hadn't really considered it or thought about anything. Um, the few ideas I've come up with haven't really made sense. Um, maybe, maybe as a, as a special thing, I'll start working on the world record hammer shot again. Try to hit 230 or something. Just a little bit of an increase. Um, so yeah, I'm radioactive and I, uh, I hope you have a great day.